How's it going, everyone? My name is Michael SK, and welcome back to Amori. So last time, we defeated Space Boyfriend, and he's back to being the Space Captain or whatever. I, I guess he's got two personalities, and when the Space Boyfriend personality comes out, it's just never good. But now we're done with the space area, or at least I think we are. I think it's time to move on, and I didn't look at this last time, but we did get another letter. Actually, we have three letters total. I didn't realize we already had B. But, yeah, we we have A, B, and E. So, still have no idea what this is spelling out. But we can definitely see that the third word starts with B. In the middle, it has an A. It's still too difficult to see what this could be. Uh, not sure where these other ones are. None of these sound familiar. But, you know what, it's a long game, I'm sure we'll come across them as we continue along. And I guess we're supposed to just head on out of here. I think we're supposed to go get snow cones or something. There's a shadow character over here. I don't know if I like that. Okay, goodbye shadow character. I have a bad feeling. Oh yeah, that's the, that's the butt certificate. Very majestic and beautiful, absolutely. Well, off to the next area, I assume. Oh. We're by ourself. Why are we by ourself? A tentacle pointing out of the- or poking out of the ground. That- that is exactly what that is. Why are we by ourself? W what happened to everybody? I don't like that we're alone. Oh no, the shadow character. I don't know if I want to follow him anymore. Can we go back? Is that something we can do? There's nothing here? Well, I'm fucked now, aren't I? So the red, uh, the red little footprints or whatever you want to call them are pointing in that direction. What's going on up here? Watermelons are my favorite part of summer. Uh... Hmm. I have a feeling that this is going to be a weird recording session. I think it was the third episode that things really got weird, just for that episode. And then after that, everything was, uh... Everything was relatively okay again. We went to space after all. Oh man, we actually, we need to go back to the main area. Now that I think about it, we have a side quest to turn in. A wish, but what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. Ah, goodbye cake. Hey, but he didn't take the watermelon down here. We have a donut. You know, it's it's something. Uh, uh-oh. Are you going on ahead? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. I don't know who these characters are supposed to be who are, who are talking. A mango smoothie. All right. Anywhere over here that we can explore? We can go, th yeah, we can, oh, there's the shadow guy again. Is there anything down here? Oh, we're missing that little area down there. I wonder who that's supposed to symbolize. It kind of looks like Basil. It kind of does. Mari's cookies. Mari's cookies have much more love baked into them and I could eat them forever. I think we're listening to somebody, if, if not just one person, then multiple people. Uh, maybe our friends? I don't know where we're at. Maybe we're getting a little bit more in touch with reality here. I want to say that's what's happening. Which means we might be visiting the real world again, which I, I don't know how I feel about that personally. The last time we visited the real world, things got really creepy. Like, oh, you know what? That's definitely Basil. It has to be. You can see his, uh, little... Ah, oh, man, we have to go to... God damn it, how do we get over there? Me and my, like, going all over the place is really just making this more annoying. I want to visit all these little pockets. I, mean, I need to see what's being said. See if there's any hints. We're still young. We should dream big, right? I'm not really sure what the overarching plot is supposed to be. But what I will say... 
is that something something ain't right and it has to do with our friends how we're imagining them here and how they are maybe in real life i mean they exist in real life we that we kind of got hinted towards that Ah. I don't like how there's shining red light coming from in there. Well, what what awaits for us in the barn? Uh oh. I don't again, not not really happy with how there's some red light there. Well, into this big ass picture frame we go. That's a picture frame, right? Oh shit. I don't like this. This immediately got spooky. For like no reason, this really got weird. Yeah, the music's gone. There's nothing. Oh, the letter F. I will gladly take that. I guess we're going the right way if we found a letter. Uh, Did that add on to our thing? It's not letting me press. Oh, there we go. Oh, the the letter F is not one of the letters we need. So actually, we might need to be careful. I'd never considered this. This is literally Hangman. We need to be cautious to make sure that we don't get the wrong letters. But I mean, there's no way that we can know what is a wrong letter or not. I don't like how there's that hanging from there. Is that a is that a noose or is that a light? That's got to be a light. There's no way. Sheet music on a music stand. All the notes have been scribbled out. Ah, yes. A happy family. Their faces look scribbled out. But then again, it's kind of hard to tell. So can we leave? Oh. Ah! Okay, well that was Basil. <sighs> hey, we're back. And we need to wake up, so it's this again. It's, it's this problem. How did we wake up last time? I don't remember. Waiting for something to happen. Okay, well the cat's not going to talk to me this time. Uh, is anything different in our sketchbook? Last time there was. And I don't know if we have any hints as to what could be going on now. I mean, yeah, that's the playground. We've, we've definitely discerned that. I, I don't know why it's written like that or drawn like that. Uh, yeah, and then that thing. I don't know what that's supposed to be, but we've seen that now a couple times. It's on the old computer. No, it's just this. Okay. A light bulb hangs from the ceiling wherever it is. We can look into the light bulb. I don't think anything will ever change with it, but it is nice to look into a pitch black light bulb. So, how do we get out of here? I know if we run around, we've got these little hands that try to fuck with us. I don't remember what we did last time to get out of here. It's been so long. Oh, you know what? I remember what we had to do. We'll we'll stand here. And yep, we have to we have to stab ourselves. I don't know why we have to do that, but we have to kill ourselves in order to get out of here. Unsure of why. Damn, I really wanted some snow cones, though. I haven't had an actual snow cone in years. That's not a lie. At that time, I saw everything. Damn. It is going to be a scary episode, isn't it? Shit. I just realized, yep, that's that's where we're headed. <clears throat> when you stood here before, did you see it too? Something behind you. Uh, no, it doesn't look like there's anything behind me right now. Maybe later. Three days left? Huh? Are we running out of time? Do we have to destroy the palace before we run out of time? Oh, thank God, it's daytime. 
At least we're not going to have to walk around this fucking spooky-ass house during the night again. Good morning is our achievement. We're sunny again, and it's sunny outside. All right. We have $30. All right. We have real money. You have a new message. Hey, Sonny, it's Mommy. How are you doing? Are you eating well? I was hoping that I could make it back to see you today, but it's the last day of a big furniture sale, and I just couldn't resist a good bargain. You can take care of yourself for a few days, right? After all, you're a big boy now. Remember to finish your chores before I get back. I left a list on the table next to your door. Oh yeah, I see it. That's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Well, that doesn't bode well. We can play blackjack? Fuck yeah, let's play some blackjack. I'm down for that. Yeah, alright. Ah, oh, shit. Do I have to bet real money? Oh, wait, no. I have $30 IRL. You know what? Let's start small. Okay. So... Yeah, I'll hit. And... Wait, did they also hit? I'm at 16. I'll stay. What do they got? God damn it, of course. Just... Just one more than me, huh? Okay, we'll do another five. It's actually been a while since I've played blackjack. Wait. Yeah, we busted. God damn it. Okay, we're, we're kind of sucking here. It's okay, though. We, we, have the, we have an opportunity for a comeback. Oh, fuck. Okay, so that's 12, 13. Okay, we need, we need to stay. We're at 20. There we go. Hell yeah. The dealer kind of fucky, though. 18? Ah, shit. Yeah, we'll stay. Of course. No, of course. It's just one more than me. It, it, it's always like that. You know what? $25. And hit. And we fucked up already. My god. Okay, another $25. Ooh, 18? Yeah, we'll, we'll stay. Don't be 20 or 19. Come on. That's fucking bullshit, dude. Come on. Well, that sucked. I, I guess I'm really bad at blackjack. I thought better of myself, but... You know... Maybe I'm just really not that good. Alright, you know what? Let's let's get back to the game here. Mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing your chores right now. Alright, well, fuck the list, I guess. Oh, no. Not this shit again. Uh, yeah, alright. We'll go fucking answer the door. That's not the right way. I don't know how to navigate this house. Why is there a pea stain here? Why? Why? Hello? Hello? Sonny? Are you there? Well, who is it? Do you remember me? It's your old friend, Kel. Is it, though? Yeah, I guess maybe it might be? So I, uh... I noticed the for sale sign in front of your house. And I, uh... Heard from my mom that you were moving away soon. I was wondering if you wanted to hang out one more time before you go or whatever. For old time's sake, you know? So that's that, that purple, the purple style of him is how we see him in our head. Uh, how does he look in real life? We turn Mari away. I'll open the door this time, alright? You know, Kel, Kel's a homie. But if the game jump scares me, for, or, or something, I'm not gonna be happy. Don't be a disfigured fit. Okay, nope, nope, it's just, it's Kel. But looking more human-ish. Oh, wow, it's nice out. Whoa, you actually came out. Uh, I mean, okay. I'm gonna be honest with you, Sonny. I really didn't expect you to come out today, so I don't really have a game plan here. Hey, I know. Let's go to Hobbies? It's the Hobby Shop in the faraway plaza. This is a lot- this is all sounding a little familiar. You remember the way, right? We used to go there all the time when we were kids. Are we not kids now? Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. 
All right. Yeah, all right. Here we go. Yeah, I've got Kel in my party now. Just uh, looking a little different. I would say a little older and obviously more human-ish. Oh, yeah, there is a for sale sign here. A for sale sign with the big red sold sticker on it. Your house has been sold. In three days, you will be moving somewhere else. Ah, okay. That's the three days left that's going on. And we can't go left. Oh, there's shoes hanging there. Uh, we can only go right. Oh, a doggo. Wait, hold up, Sonny. I know it's been a while since you've been over at my place, but now might not be a good time. <laughs> Just wanted to visit the doggo. Whose house is this? Oh, well, he's not saying anything this time. There's no response. Okay, good. I don't know. I don't know whose house this is. I'm just gonna go to everybody's house and you know, see what's going on. No response. Damn, is nobody home? I have no idea where I'm going. I'm gonna assume it's not that way because we have to cross the street. And I'm not about that life. Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to cross the street now. Ooh, soda. A vending machine. And we can't get any. Who's this? Oh, we're at an actual playground. With little critters and shit running around. A preacher. I'm on my way to the church, but it's a ritual of mine to take a quick stroll before delivering my sermons. I've had horrible st uh, stage fright ever since I was a child, but a scenic walk always seems to calm my nerves. Okay. Pretty boy. Life's been kind of stressful lately, but people watching out here helps me put things into perspective. I might make it a habit to come to this park more often. I guess sometimes all it takes to relax is to stop and smell the roses. It's very strange because, you know, these are all humans and shit. We're in reality, but then you have all that happening in the playground. An artist is diligently sketching away. Whoa, that's a cool drawing of the park you have there. Ah, oh, hi there. Thank you. I'm just practicing. That's what you call practicing? But it looks so real. I bet you could even sell that for money. Don't you think so, Sonny? Uh, yes. See? Even Sonny agrees with me. Heck, I'd buy that from you right now. Hey, Sonny, can you lend me $20? What the fuck? Thanks. That's so nice of you, but it's not for sale. It's for my portfolio. I'm trying to get into art school next year. Ah, darn, that's too bad. That would have looked great on my bedroom wall. You really think so? Mincy, huh? I'm Kel, and this is Sunny. Hi, Kel and Sunny. It's nice to meet both of you. It's nice to meet you too, Mincy. Ah, <sighs> What's wrong? No, oh, it's nothing. You're the first person to say something positive about my drawings. Sometimes when I'm feeling down, it makes me question myself, and it gets hard to move my pencil. No way. I don't believe that at all. I really think your drawing is great. I wouldn't be able to do that in a million years. Don't be so hard on yourself, Mincy. Me and Sonny believe in you. <sighs> yeah, you're right. I just gotta shake off those bad feelings. I'll, I'll try to buckle down and finish this now. That's the spirit. See you around, Mincy. You got this. Well, we made a friend, whether we wanted to or not. There's a hobo over there. Ah, <sighs> So we're kind of blending a little bit of, uh, reality and what's fake here. Is the cat real? The orange cat looks hungry. Feed it some fit. Do we have fish? Ah, damn it. Okay, so... I guess that answered a little bit of my confusion. What is going down there- or going on down there in the lower left? That's very suspicious. A jock. Oh, hey. What's up? What are you doing here, Kel? You from around this part of town? Oh, whoa, I didn't expect to see you here, Jay. Sonny, this is Jay. He's the captain of the football team at my high school. I didn't know you played basketball, too. Eh, uh, I'm just here to kill time. It's more of a hobby than anything. You're trying out for the basketball team this year, right, Kel? Maybe you can teach me some of your tricks. Yeah, definitely, that sounds like fun. But maybe another time. My childhood friend Sonny here is leaving town in the next few days, so we're hanging out all day today. I'll definitely catch up with you later, though. Sure, we can set something up next week. Same time, same place? 
Yep, sounds good. See you there. I I think there was like a misspelling in that. We are recycletists, followers of the holy bin. Okay. All I all as all have littered, all must accept that they are trash. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. I kind of regret talking to that guy. I don't I don't know why. I just feel major regret. I probably feel regret with this guy too. The stench of this man is indescribable. What you making that face for, bub? Is there something on my face? All right, let's get out of here. I don't want to talk to that guy. Oh, we never talked to this person. Hello, youngings. I don't know if you've been watching where you're stepping, but there's quite a bit of trash around this town. If you happen to find any, can you bring it to me so I can dispose of it properly? Come on, youngins. Let's help the world one step at a time. Do I have actually anything in my pocket? Nope. Different, uh, different set of stuff going on here. Kel has a lot of health. And a lot of juice. Wait, what level is he? Oh, we don't have levels. This is, this is not the RPG world, after all. He has to encourage and guard. Maybe, maybe there is some RPG elements when we're in the real world. I don't know. We got this person to talk to. I'm just talking to everybody. I'd like to fully explore this area. Drink apple juice. Have you heard the phrase, or ever heard the phrase, an apple a day keeps the doctor away? The same concept applies to apple juice. Apple juice supports hydration. It contains beneficial plant compounds and may support heart health. It may also protect your brain as you age. There are no downsides as far as I'm concerned. Well, I mean, I'll, I'll take your word for it. Another homeless man. When I was younger, my family used to go to this park a lot. I remember there being a lake with a statue in the middle, but I can't find it anywhere. And we got this guy. Oh, ho, 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 ho. hello. <coughs> uh, today is such a beautiful day, don't you think? I may not have any money, but at least sunlight is free. Yeah, you can get you can get your old vitamin D supplements through the sun. That is for sure true. Uh, let's go this way. I don't know if we're going in the right direction, but, you know, we're, we're trying our best. We found a coin. Nice. There we go. Oh, we got some shops here. Oh, hobbies. That's where we're supposed to go. Come on, Sonny. Let's go to hobbies first. So I can't, I can't go anywhere. Yep, I can't go into any of these places. Oh, this guy. Yeah, he's going to tell me about orange juice. Orange is the happiest color. I've actually, yeah, I've never, uh... I've never heard any of that. Let's let's get out of here. I don't I don't want to I don't want to get sold on orange juice. Though I will say orange juice is much better than apple juice in my opinion. I I uh Hmm. Interesting. We found space boyfriend or space ex-boyfriend if you will. I just made a wish that I would meet my one true love today. Good luck with that. <laughs> Got him. Oh, interesting. That's where our mind was. Well, here we are at Hobbies. It's probably been a while since you were here, but it hasn't really changed all that much. It's all the same old stuff. Captain Spaceboy games, sweetheart movies, and a few pet rocks. Except now they're vintage. It's all coming together. Actually, since we're here, I should probably buy a gift for Hero. He's in college right now, but he should be coming back sometime tomorrow. He's studying to be a doctor, so maybe I should buy him... some medicine? No, that's a horrible idea. You should help pick out the gifts, Sonny. Let's look around and see what there is. Alright. That's so weird. Everything's kind of coming together. Sonny here has a crazy imagination. Something's going on with him for sure. A new video game called Super Ultra Sprout Mole Eater Revenge of the Moles 3. Rated M for Mature, huh? That's too violent for Hero. He definitely wouldn't or won't appreciate something like this. Uh, what about a book? Or these are DVDs, I guess. Chock full of DVDs. A lot of these DVDs are catching dust. I'm sure we have most of these somewhere at home already. Probably also catching dust. As is tradition with DVDs. A bunch of small figurines. I've always been fond of these little guys. 
Hero would get mad at me for spending my lunch money on them, though. Let's not remind him of that. A cardboard cutout of Captain Space Boy. Wow, we even used the, like, the actual name in the, uh... I, 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 I don't know, what is it called? His Imagination World? It has a name to it, I just cannot remember. This place is kind of small, but it has a lot of old and rare collectibles. People even come all the way from the city to shop here. Yeah, there's a, uh... I was in, um, a nearby city that has a hobby shop like this, of old and new stuff, and... You know, we were there, me and my friend, taking care of something else, and... You know, we stopped by. But yeah, I, I totally believe that people go out of their way to go to places like these. A bunch of small figurines. Okay, yeah, we've 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 already gotten the rundown on this one. Oh, these might be books. Comics. Looking through these comics brings back so many memories. It's just like old times, huh, Sonny? Hero was never too interested in comics, though. Maybe we're in the wrong store for this shit. A game called Captain Space Boy's Space Adventure. It cost one dollar to play. Hey, Sonny, let's get Hero's gift first. We can play later. I am kind of down to play, though. An old video game console system hooked up to a TV. I already have this console, Sonny. And I don't think I can afford to. Kel, how have you been, buddy? It's been a while since you've come around, hasn't it? Oh, what about this guy? My favorite novel just got a comic adaptation. But the main character looks nothing like how I imagined him. That's usually how it be. What have we not looked at? I guess these here in the middle. Some colorful CDs. Maybe you could play them at a jukebox. These CDs look pretty cool, but I think Hero would appreciate something more sentimental. Let's keep looking. We're kind of running out of ideas here. A brand new game console system. It looks so shiny and sleek. This thing is way too expensive, Sunny. Look at that face. I love Hero and all, but not that much. That's fair. That is fair. The capsule machine. It's three dollars a try. Yeah, I know. We'll, we can play later. I, I get it. Yeah, we're, we're kind of running out of ideas here. There's like nothing else to look at. Or at least I don't think there is. Playing cards are scattered across the table. Yeah, nothing to do with those. Oh. This. Yes. This is perfect. Papa Chips chip off the old block comic book. Wow, that's a mouthful. Hero had a copy of this when we were kids, but our dog Hector destroyed it. He's going to be so happy when he sees this. But before that, we need to ask the most important question. How much does it cost? $20? This is extortion. Shoot, I left my wallet at home. Uh, can you spot me, Sonny? I'll pay you back, I promise. Thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. We're slowly but surely losing our, our little bit of money. You took Hero's gift off the shelf. I guess we don't have to go through this guy. We'd like... Oh, I guess we have to, yeah. We'd, we'd like to buy this cookbook, please. How have you been, buddy? It's been a while since you... Yeah, we already said this. That's Papa Chip's Chip Off the Old Block Cookbook. I think I said comic book earlier. If I did, I apologize. I'm an idiot. I see you have good taste. Yeah, my brother used to follow his recipes all the time. His cookies were my favorite. It's rare that I see another fan of Papa Chip's work. It'll be $20, please. Thank you, kind sirs. Please enjoy. Alrighty, we got Hero's Gift. Let's bounce on out of here. Thanks a lot, Sonny. I bet Hero will love this. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else to look at in here. So, where do you want to go now, Sonny? Guess there's really not much to do around the suburbs, huh? Oh, how about the faraway park? Yeah, the park. Weren't we just there? We passed it. Yeah, we, we were literally just there. That sounds fun, doesn't it? Yep, back to doing all that, I guess. We can check out these other places if we want. Out of laziness, I kind of don't want to. And it looks like uh, Captain Space Boy is no longer standing up there. I guess he kind of got tired of existing in this realm.